Hi, I'm Wilson Curry. Welcome to Antiques Country. And today I'm standing on this overlook high above Blue Mountain Lake here in the beautiful Adirondack Mountains in northern New York. And every year late in September, these mountains play host to one of the most unique antique shows in the country, featuring rustic old lodge furniture, vintage canoes, pack baskets, moose heads, and more in the Adirondack style. Now the show officially opens tomorrow, but we've come in ahead of time so we can share all the behind the scene activities with you. Well, this incredible event takes place each year here at the Adirondack Museum, and you'd be hard pressed to find a better place for it. So we were truly pleased when the good folks here at the museum and the show promoters invited us not only to the actual antique show tomorrow, but to the pre-opening events which are taking place today, there by invitation only. There's a great deal of activity going on, plenty to see, a big party, and lots of antiques. Is this yours? Yes. Uh -huh. And your name? It's Christine Gill. Christine. Christine, can you tell us something about this bench? I mean, I know it's root furniture, and I think anybody that sees this is pretty much self-explanatory, yeah. but it's, this is signed by someone. It's actually signed and made by Henry Arena, and uh, he was just an outstanding uh, furniture maker. He didn't make very many pieces, though, and that's why his pieces are quite well okay. done and also quite rare. Okay, so you have, you have that right on the tag. Yep. Okay, so now, Christina, uh, what are we talking here? About seven thousand dollars, aren't yes. we? Well, mm -hmm. I imagine it took old Henry a few hours to make that piece. Well, this certainly is a beautiful, stylistic birdhouse. Now, I don't see any price on that, so must mean it's free. Mary Lou from Country Living Magazine. Mary Lou, Creechy. this is Creechy. 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 Yes. It's Mary Lou Creechy, Country Living Magazine. Mary Lou, what a fantastic show, and I know you people are involved in it. Tell us a little yes, bit about Country Living. Yes, we've sponsored the show since the uh, conception of the show seven years ago. And the reason that we're involved in it, because it celebrates what our readers love, and that is the great outdoors and a sp uh, sort of a, a slice of America. Because this is the way, this represents the way people used to live at the turn of the century here in the Adirondacks. I think there's people living in the Adirondacks now who are reliving the past by virtue of being able to acquire this furniture now as well. Yes, and what's really fun about it is that they, you know, it's not going to disappear. Quote moccasins, they're full of soul. <laughs> okay, we're here. The canoe of all time. Orrin Becker, I know you own this. Come on, tell me about this canoe. Okay. I see trophies, I see plaques. What does this mean to us? It means that uh, it's, it, the boat was built in 1911 by Ted Shea. Um, it was at Clayton this year. It did one nine, in 1995. It won uh, Best Antique Craft of the Year. And this year they got all the winners together and it won overall with that. Well, it's. Orrin, this is probably, incidentally, this is Orrin Becker, and he's actually from Western New York area, and uh, you come up every year to the show? I do, I do. Orrin, do you tie this on the roof of the van when you come up, or? Uh... I actually had it on my blazer right <laughs> <I did. laughs> Well, it probably draws a great deal of attention, but everything at the show has its price. That's yes, right. That's okay? Good. All right? Okay, you have this tag, as it says, original 1911 Ted Shea, built many awards, and it can be yours for $10,500, and Orrin will throw in two paddles. There you go. 